and welcome back. If it's Friday, it's time for Club Ed with Liz Winstead, co-creator of The Daily Show and the brains behind Wake Up World, which uh, you can watch at www.wakeupworld.tv. Gosh. Nice shirt. Do you like your face? You kind of look crazy in it. But you know what? Here's what I'm glad, Ed, is that you realize that I am a woman who is not too fat to be a model for your clothes. <laughs> right, okay. Unlike Fashion Week. All right. Well, we say in Minnesota, nice fish. I'll say nice shirt. All right. Let's. let's... <laughs> <laughs> All right. I, I've got to ask you about. We, here we go. We're going through another Sarah Palin. A book. Can, can we get through this? You know, here's what's interesting. She's doing another book, and I was reading what it was going to be, and it said that the book will include passages from other books that she likes, and then also <laughs> tributes to people she admires, which, isn't that a magazine? Isn't that what magazines are? <laughs> she's not even writing it. It's just other things that she's culled from other people. And what do we call the reality TV show? I think we should call it So You Think You Can Think. <laughs> so you or who wants to make me a millionaire? Those are my two picks for the name of her reality show. All right. The story about this Republican who is uh, openly anti-gay uh, gets caught. Uh, it's a DUI coming home from a gay nightclub. And it's crazy. Only you can talk about this, by the way. Well, what's <laughs> nuts is he is vehemently anti-gay, vehemently gay legislator, uh, goes to a gay club, uh, gets hammered and then blows a point one four. That, that would be very intoxicated, yes, as I understand exactly. the Yes, exactly. And um, and and uh, yeah. And who knows about other things that were blown? All right. Now, all I'm saying is that. All right. Now, Liz, you you have you have been around television newsrooms uh, in the entertainment business a long time. Yes. You got to do the commentary for us on this Italian broadcaster doing a newscast and something. Very strange breaks out right behind him. Here okay. it is. All right. This, this this is this is the videotape of an Italian guy. There he is. Yeah. What, what what what's this all about? Well, I think it looks like me and Heidi Harris behind him going at it. Where does she come from? No fact to stand? Honestly, Ed, why does she keep coming on your show? The woman has never said one correct thing. And look, there's me taking it to Heidi. Boom, Heidi. Lies. Boom. Boom about the waterboarding. Boom. There you go. And Heidi's down. I am the victor. All right. Back to the serious stuff. Yes. What about uh, the KSM trial? Ed, the whole thing kind of freaks me out because it looks like when it comes to any kind of national security thing, whether it's wiretapping, Obama will say one thing, and then one of those Cheneys breaks free from the cave and loosens the chains and goes on, and then Obama switches his position, whether it's that, it's, it's the, the photos of the detainees, now it's the trial. I'm starting to think that possibly Dick Cheney is Barack Obama's queen of diamonds, and we're living in some kind of weird version of the men. Cheney and candidate. <laughs> Liz Winstead, great to have you with us Thanks, again Ed. in Club Ed tonight on a Friday night. Tonight in our tech survey, I asked you, do you believe uh, Blanche Lincoln deserves President Obama's support? 6%. 6% said yes. 94% said no. That's the Ed Show. I'm Ed Schultz. Hardball with Chris Matthews starts right now on the Place for Politics MSN.